The United Nations report has it that an estimated 736 million women, that is one in every three women, have experienced sexual violence in the course of their lifetime. With 30% of these women aged 15 and older. And this statistic doesn't even start to include women facing sexual harassment. Most recently, Warif in Nigeria carried out a study among teenage boys. And 81% of those boys said rape is as a result of the victim's fault instead of the perpetrator's fault. Also, a large percentage of those boys, one in five, said they will not intervene when they are passing and they see a girl being harassed. That is boys at secondary school level. This is very alarming and this is what inspired this particular bucket list of mine. I have traveled vastly across Nigeria and at every point I can't say I feel safe. Uh, I barely ever feel safe because I'm unable to defend myself. I've had situations, very sticky situations, and I could only come up by the grace of God. These things happen to women and sometimes they never make it out alive. So today I will be joining CJN, he's a Taekwondo second degree belt holder and he will be teaching us basic self-defense skills women can use to stay safe. We also have something planned for you that is at home and cannot join us on this day, I mean at the venue. We're here at Bodyline Fitness, amazing place, phenomenal and we will be heading in now. So no face mask, no entry. So let's get this party on the road. CJN of CJN Fitness. He is a second degree black belt holder in Taekwondo and he will be putting us through the self-defense crash course today. We have something for you at the end of the video so you want to stick to the end and also we have the unbeatable champion of the boxing. His name is Arinze Chuku and he will be teaching us um, the basics about boxing. So this is going to get pow pow. I hope I get them right by the end of the video. As I said, we have something for you, CJN Fitness and I, at the end of this video. So, let's go. Okay, so it's time for practical sessions. But before we start, I would like us to understand certain things about self-defense. Now, self-defense goes beyond punching, kicking, and striking. The best or the most important part of any self-defense is preventing that situation from happening before it happens. Mm. That is the best form of self-defense. Some people will tell you, oh, it is if you run away, you're a coward. It's not true. You actually run away to avoid what might happen because someone's or people's life might end up getting involved. So the best form of self-defense is avoiding it from happening before it happens and how do you avoid it by following basic simple security steps because we're doing this strictly for the ladies for today and ladies are known to be i don't want to use the word absently minded when they look into their phones but it's always important wherever you are at any point in time always take note of your surroundings your environment you don't walk alone and even if you do watch it's easier for you to detect any form of threats before it happens, when you are at an alert, when your eyes are open, it's very important. Secondly, if you are going out in the night, walking alone on the streets, try as much as possible not to do it alone. Go out with somebody you know. Try. Because most assaults actually comes from people you know, not just strangers. Yes. It comes from people you know. Either a friend is setting yeah. you up. Partner violence. You understand what I'm saying? Yes. So the best form of self-defense is avoiding it from happening. Okay. It saves everyone distress. But what if it happens? What do you do and how do you do? Myself and my friend here, we are going to be showing us just a few, a few of the things you can do with your hands and your legs. And since I said it's for the ladies, we are going to look at how your fashion accessories can help you. Your fashion nails, your nails, it's not just for fashion, it's not just for marketing. Yeah. You use it as a weapon to hurt yourself 
when it arises. What do you do with your high heel shoes? Is it just for catwalking? No. You are going to learn something new that your high heel shoes are not just for catwalking. I said something about your nails. I said something about high heel shoes, right? Yes. Yeah. Then your, your ring. I know for the married ladies, they have that pendant on their ring. What do they Some, call it? Uh, diamond ring. Diamond, stones. right? Stones. Some are diamond though, but stones. Yeah. Most assume they are diamonds. So diamond. let's not bring them out. So that stuff too, you can use it as a weapon. So okay. I'm going to use those things to demonstrate with my partner what and how you can defend yourself when the situation arises. So the first thing you need to do is this. Make sure your supposed assailant and your supposed attacker is always at a distance away from you. That's all. You need to keep the supposed assailant or attacker at a distance, okay? So the three things you can do to keep him at a distance is one, he comes slowly. My leg is in the front, yeah? So when he's coming, I stamp on his knee. That's one, which takes him back. Yes. Or two, go back again. He has to come forward, step, I kick in. Okay. To destabilize. Thirdly, he's trying to come in slowly. I go to the groin, but it has to be fast. Because you ask Which a valid question. Response. What happens? Response. The moment you delay, he can catch the leg and do whatever he wants. Okay. To do. Yeah? okay. Yeah. So those are just the three basic there are so many other things you do with the leg, but yeah. for okay. the purpose of our women, we'll do something that is easy. And easy to remember. Exactly. You can actually do it from the back leg. I used the leg in the front, right? Yes. Because of the way I was standing. standing. If I'm to come from the back, okay, he's rushing towards me. Come. Okay. So stem. Because so this stays balanced. It just yeah. yeah. Okay. It's like a push kick. Yeah? Okay. You can do it with your heel. Whatever with balance. your heel. Whatever you're more balanced. Yes, your heel or you go flat with the foot. Okay. Whichever works for you. If I'm to do the next one, which, you know, before I went this way. in, okay. this time around, he comes and I take it out. out. Yeah? So, I'll do it fast now, you see. Yeah? Okay. So, if it's coming, bam! With control. So, yeah? so if I come, you have actu actually there are basics to this. Okay, mm? okay. So I stand on my toe, he tries to come and you shock him in. You actually kick to destabilize him. And like we always say, the moment you do that and the balance is there, you do what? One, two, three. Do you understand? They call this. Yeah, yeah of course, it should pay you because they're not used to it. Yes, I noticed. That's why we practice consistently. <laughs> okay. But you're fine. Okay. Yeah? yeah, I'm fine. Oh, yeah. Constant practice helps you develop these skills. Okay. That's why we tell you that in self defense, you cannot predict where the opponent is attacking from. Okay. So, but constant practice of this builds your reflex. Yes. So that the person, the moment the person moves, you can predict at least half of what he wants to do. And by his because time. yes, no matter how someone wants to attack, if you look at the body, the shoulders, you, you know, know, know what part is coming. First. Okay. Except if the person is an experienced fighter, where well, he can fake you with this and come with this, or fake you with this and come with this, or fake you with this and still come with this. <laughs> Probably not the finish. <laughs> yes. <laughs> what happens if he comes too close? Let's say you ask the question, there's a wall behind me mm. and I cannot run. Okay, fine, no problem. First things first, most times when someone wants to strike you on the head, if I come this way, good. But natural human instinct will tell you to raise your hand up. It's like when you were small, when your mommy wants to flog you. What do you do? You do this, right? Yes. That's to tell you that as, all, as a living thing or as a human, we all have that defensive instinct inbuilt. But how we use it is what matters. Constant practice, like I said before, helps you, you know, get used to it. Okay. So, okay, now there's a wall behind me, and this man is already too close to me. He tries to punch me with this. You go slowly, and I show. Yeah? So if he's coming slowly, go. One. I parry. I parry. Again, slowly. Now look at my leg. Yeah? Go. One. I'm not just doing this, come. If I do this, 
I don't have a balance. That's you, one. You stagger. Yes, I'll stagger. Secondly, I'm exposed. But the moment he locks me up in a corner, I automatically activate my defense mode. No more running away. There's no space to run, right? So he comes slowly. One, two. This is free. Three. Yeah? Very fast. Good. Slow again. One, two. Hammer fist. Three. I take it slow one more time. Slow one more time. One, two. Yeah? Yeah. Hammer fist. Three. Three. Okay. Now we are going fast. So we see. Yeah? So are we ready? Let's go. Straight. Bam, bam. That was fast. Yeah? Yeah, okay. So again. Oh. Ah. So it's like a so it's not mosquito. Yeah. yeah? We're not, not chasing not mosquito. mosquito yeah? okay? so you like parry, you call it parry. parry. Yeah. Yeah? Slow for her to see. Slow. Okay. You, you push it off because yeah. it's physics. Yes. He is already in motion coming with full force. So the moment you tamper with this, it leaves here. It leaves here open and I go with the hammer fist strike. So let's go fast one more time. Yeah? One more time. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Again. Yeah. <laughs> One more time. Yes. Simultaneous. Yeah? Pam, pam. It's a simultaneous movement. You can do the same thing this in other way, in reverse. So he comes slowly from the left. One. Two. Yeah? Slowly. One. Two. So if he's to go fast. Yeah? Two. Yeah? Go. Pam. Okay, so it goes to the back and for that back because you have the kidneys and the the kidneys, the, the livers and, and the likes of them below. So it further destabilizes. Exactly. Yeah? Yeah. So come with this side slow. The first one, one, two, yeah? then fast. Yeah. Yeah. It's here the same thing. Yeah. You go one, two. Yeah. Yeah. Parry. The moment you parry, parry there's no balance, do. then you, there's no delay, no time for delay, okay? Then the second one again, still the same line of action, mm. still the same line, uh, line of attack. He comes slowly to my head. If I stay there, I will receive whatever he has to offer. <laughs> yeah, but okay. if I don't stay there, you come slowly, same thing, one, parry. you parry. Mm -hmm. Opposite hand. Yes. This is his right. Yes. This is my left. left. I parry. parry same hammer fist the to the temple. Oh, to the temple specifically? Yes. Why? Because it can knock him out. Oh, okay. So it has to be... A very good. So you have to... Even if he's taller than me. What? My knuckle. My knuckle goes to the temple. temple. Yeah? Okay. So slowly. One. Two. Yeah? One more time slow. One. You parry. Two. Okay. Hmm? So if it's done, I won't hit you. So if it's going fast, no, no. If it's going fast, eh? Yeah, yeah, pam, pam. Okay. Simultaneous, yeah. He's coming. Punch. I'm still trying to hand of hand. Good. Okay, so the hand goes this way. Parry. Then this comes. From then up this or comes down? up. Up. Okay. Yeah. You parry it down. Parry down. So okay, it's so it saves you time. Yeah. It saves you some hand. tangling your hand. Yeah. As a huge fan of beads and beaded accessories, my current plug is ZBD. So ZBD has been magnanimous enough to give us a 10% discount on all purchases for the next two weeks. All you have to do is use the code BKXZB to get 10% discount of waist bead, anklets, necklaces, bracelets, as well as beaded bags. You name it, she makes it. Send her a message at ZBD. You're welcome. So he's holding me this way, right? Yes. 
if I am lucky, my hands could be free. Mm. But in this case, the hands are not free. Mm. So what do I do? How do I help myself? First of all, my head is free. Yeah? Mm -hmm. You can take it back. He might not know. He knows now. That's why he's, uh, he's avoiding me. Yes. But on a normal day, being a lady, they might not expect it. Yes. I have my high heel here. Ooh. Yeah? Okay. The cover yeah. shoe. One, that is it. Stomp on the... You stomp or his shin. The heel of your shoe, you brush it on the, on the, the brush. Oh, that's going to be painful. Yeah, it has to be now. Okay. He's trying to kill you. He's trying to... Secondly, his toes. Yeah? Okay. Take up with the head and you smash, smash. the toes. Mm. Yeah? Okay. That's two, right? Yes. The third one. My legs are free. Mm -hmm. Palm. Mm. To the federal government. Uh, federal government, yes. Yeah, the drawing, yeah? Yes. The last one you can still try to do here. Open your legs. Mm. Sit. Now, this is my I'm not trying to open my hand up. Mm. You try to go sideways. Grab his okay. leg. Raise. Oh, that is, that is like a really so grab. And you yeah. sit and pull. You sit okay. on the knee. Sit on the knee and pull. Because what happens is your knee can only bend this way. Mm. It cannot go this way. So when you force this way, okay. it becomes a problem to you. Okay. okay. Yeah. Also, if he's still holding me that way, and my hands are free, better for you. Yeah? Mm. My hands are free. One to the face. Mm -hmm. So, so don't worry, I won't hit you. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So one, two, or I still repeat what I did before. Just look for one of the fingers. Back. And twist and break. When you bend, mm. not just breaking the finger, but you go for the wrist, wrist. as well. Okay. Because when you bend this and this, he starts to try to There's no way. He literally begins to give me chance. Okay. Then from there, I do what I want to do. Remember. Most important, you run. You run. And not just whatever you do, you do with speed. Time is of the essence. Yeah? Okay. See about the nails. I mentioned something about nails before, right? If he's holding me this way, it happens a lot. Mm -hmm. Yeah, when forward attacks are. Yes, it happens a lot. Yes. Yeah? Yeah. My nails are there. No matter how heavy the duty, I will come through the muscles here. Yeah. True or false? Yeah. True. Your nails dip into the ear. Okay. And hold in there and press. Okay. So that you hear what you are forced. Yeah? Okay. Or. Eyeballs, the nails, the nails still go to that eye, you select it very well. Okay. And you should push it in. Okay. Even if it's choking you out, mm -hmm. two of us should go down together. Okay. I you get you still with the same nail. He nostrils. Dip it inside and hold his face and bring it up. This is getting mm -hmm. dark. Yeah. I mean it survival is a, is a serious. <laughs> it has to. Okay. Yeah? So the same thing with your nails, yeah? Okay. What do you nose call this bridge. part? The bridge of the nose. The bridge of the nose is also soft. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Let me show you something. No, 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 no. no calm down, calm yeah. down. I want you to have a feel of what it looks like. I'm not okay. hitting you, just calm down. Your nose is too precious for us. To Thank you, I'm glad. So, yes, yes. Okay, if I do, it goes really good. Uh -huh. Okay. You, you should feel, feel something good. So, imagine you, oh, imagine you either hitting somebody that way yeah. or putting your hand in this way to beat. Okay. I'm putting your hand in this way with your elbow. So you will feel it. You will feel it. Good. Mm -hmm. Do you understand? Yeah. So like I said before, thank you very much. So like I said before, self-defense moves are, are, are they are not something you you predict. But constant practice helps you to know. Constant practice rather builds that ref uh, reflex. Mm -hmm. So when someone wants to naturally, if you are attacking, naturally. It is natural for me to do that. Shake. It is natural. Okay? But constant points will help you predict which points? the possible points where the attack is coming from. Why? If you are trying to strike somebody with this arm and I look at you, automatically that point, that side begins to move. Mm, yes. Because even when someone is angry at you and the person is shouting towards you, are you mad? Are you already know the Before words. you know it, it's the slack. direction of the person's body, you know where the hand is coming from. That's why I told okay. you, observe the environment. If you are in the public place, someone starts shouting at you. Are you mad? You decrease self-defense. Don't allow that person to come. Reach you. Maintain distance. You are not a coward. Yeah. It doesn't mean you are a coward. It doesn't mean you are a coward. The best form of self-defense is stopping it before it becomes. So, let me try one or two. Which one do you like to try? 
Um, let, let's let's try uh, anyone. Just anyone. Yes. Yeah, anyone. So, so I'm going to attack. Just make sure you don't hit me. Oh, yeah. <laughs> if I hit you, it's going to be like. Okay. Okay. Yeah? So so I will attack. Mm -hmm. You defend yourself. Okay. okay? So where are we? So before I come close to you, stop me. You think you want to force me? Yes. So I'm coming close to you. Okay, yes. What do I you remember? Bam, ah, that's good. One, okay. yeah? So when Four, I come close, this. two, Four, in. Good, now you don't do this one. <laughs> okay, because yeah? it just. Aha, uh -huh. you see, it's, it looks. Okay. You felt funny. I felt funny. Good, so if you're doing that, remember all of the feet. There's a okay, turn. So it's... Oh. Together. Something like that, yeah. But we don't do okay. Practice though, practice, so practice like you don't keep spinning again. and non stop. Yeah, so okay. practice makes perfect. So, so, first one you saw us doing if I'm coming close to you, you go for the knee, right? Yeah, so if I'm coming, bam, okay, that's the first one. You yes, remember. one, so you dig in, in, kick it out this time around, okay, with this, with yeah? this leg, yeah, stand the steady way you are, okay. So, if I'm coming to you, okay. no. no, with this, like this, bam, boom, but well, it felt funny. It's first one because you are doing this. Okay. I will do this. Okay, so like this. Go. Huh? Okay. So two. Ah, go. So I'm supposed to go down this way. I have my legs enough to bring anybody down with that left leg. Okay. What is it? Now you go for the knee. Okay. I think this is the big leg. Go. I think this is. Yeah. So when I come. Ah. So. I and the moment I do this, I'm giving you my head to do See. what. Anything you want Anything to do. Anything you want to do. You can use your knee. The hand, the nails. Oh, your knee. Or the knee. Bah. Depends on what you're wearing. Two. Yeah. One so one. it's basically up to you to decide the situation and pick which one. The nails, the shoe, the rings, or the run. Exactly. Okay. So that's why I tell you, you can't predict. Okay. Your constant practice develops. Okay, so Thank you. Sorry, I want the matrix recently. I want the matrix recently. So, so, so. Okay, okay. Stand properly. Stand. You have stand. To. Okay. Now, come slowly. Uh, sorry, yeah. it was this, then this. I... Oh. Oh, okay. Slowly. Oh. Side step. Carry. Side so, so, so step. 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 Carry. Good. Then you carry with the arm and you practice. Carry. I, honestly, at this point, I have forgotten. Like, no, 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 I haven't forgotten, okay. but like, I'm trying to pick out which one, so it's just moving in my that head. That is why it's constant practice. Okay, yes, mm -hmm. obviously. You can get so, to my leg, okay? You come slowly, I do it so you see. Okay, so come. One, you okay. see my leg? Yes. Okay. Two. Two. Three. Okay. So if you come. So try one before we round it. Just try one. Yeah? Okay. So I come. Okay, okay you want to oh, see again? Yeah, yes, please. Okay, go slowly. Okay. See my leg. Okay, so. One. One. Uh -huh. Two. Uh -huh. I'm hiring the handle. Three. Hand. Three. Stomach. Bam. Okay. Uh, hammer fist to the ribs. That last ribs in a break. Okay. Yeah. So, um, so okay. I come slowly. Slowly. Mm -hmm. Okay. Slice. One. Hurry. Hurry. Uh -huh. Two. Oh, it's down. Two comes from here. Sorry, what? <laughs> <laughs> I forgot. Okay, I know that you're parrying with which hand? This hand? If I'm facing you this way. Mm -hmm. You're parrying? Okay. Parrying this, parrying this way. I'm stepping out. You're stepping out. And then doing that. Okay. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Okay, so do that. So I'm coming slowly. Mm -hmm. Parrying. Uh -huh. So it's there. Something, -ish. something like Ish. that. Okay. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. So, side step. Sorry, last one. I, I hope. So, you're parrying. So, if you are standing from that direction, uh, since you are standing here, I want to show you this. Parry this way. Okay, you parry this way. Oh, away from you. That's away what I'm away from your okay, line. Okay, okay, just stand mm -hmm. like this. Let's see. Away from your line. So, this leg has to move from here. Mm -hmm. One. You're parrying. So, this goes this way. As you're parrying, you're parrying. So, see what we'll do. Let's break it down. Make it easy for you. From here, just go okay. one, one, two, two, then three. Make your fist. Go to this one, back fist. Bow. Okay, oh, Bow. yeah, that is a lot easier Bow. than yeah. the first time. Yes, you have to okay, so. the hip. Bow. Okay, so um, one, two, one, one, two, two, two three. So take it down. Yeah. Down. Out of your line of sight. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah I think so I remember. Let's try. We'll go okay. slowly. Okay. Slowly. Okay. Go. One. 
Language is normal. It's either we speak Korean or we yeah. use Hangul or we use English. Okay, so, so how do you say thank you? Kam the bow. Yeah, Kamsamida. 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 So, like this? Kamsamida? Yeah. Okay. Kamsamida means thank you. So, Kamsamida CJN. Kamsamida PK. <laughs> come so many for watching uh to come your way next time don't forget to like comment subscribe and turn on post notification as promised cgn and i have something for you he will be giving out one hour virtual um self-defense class we will put the description um the details in the description and flyers will be out to your friends tell your friends friends safety is everyone's concern even though we hope that the main causes of um um gbv or harassment or whatever stop which are the perpetrators to be fair but we still have to take safety measures to keep ourselves safe and our loved ones do well to share this with women in your life you love and you would want to keep seeing um till we come your way next time bye bye